And Virginia lawmakers now calling for a federal investigation after hundreds of drivers, you've certainly seen the video, were trapped in their cars on I-95 during this week's snowstorm. Now, traffic came to a standstill on Monday night into Tuesday morning as several vehicles were involved in crashes. And police and rescue crews, they could not get to that scene to clear those accidents. Some people stranded in their cars on the highway for almost an entire day. And during that storm, a Baltimore-based bakery actually came to the rescue to help feed dozens of hungry travelers who were stranded right on that stretch of the highway. And WJZ Live at H&S Bakery in Fells Point, our Amy Kawada spoke with the local couple and how they helped make this all happen. This is such a great story, Amy. Yeah, Rick, definitely. Well, it was quite the road trip to remember for Casey and her husband, John. They were one of hundreds of people stranded and stuck on that frozen highway in Virginia for over 24 hours. But they were able to find a silver lining through it all when they noticed a Schmidt Baking Company truck also stranded on the road with them. A nightmare of a road trip saved by a truck full of baked goods. It was our 15 or 16 that we realized that we were probably screwed. What was supposed to be a five hour road trip from Ellicott City to North Carolina for Casey Houlihan and her husband, John Noe, ended up to be well over 24 hours due to a massive snowstorm freezing them in place along I 95. So we were nervous, we were frustrated, we were starving. After being stranded for nearly a full day with no access to food or water, Hulahin spotted a glimmer of hope a few cars ahead of them, a Schmidt Baking Company truck. We kind of made a joke about how nice it would be just to even have a loaf of bread right then because we hadn't eaten in about 37 hours. That's when she decided to call the company's customer service hotline, only to hear back from one of the owners, Chuck Paterakis. And I says, you know what we could do, Casey? Just walk up to the driver. I told the driver to give two or three loaves of bread out to each person. Schmidt Baking Company is part of H&S Family of Bakeries, which has been instilled in the Baltimore community for nearly 80 years. Paterakis says it was the easiest decision he's made. So one of our mission statements is to create a meaningful change in our community. And I think this was an example of how we live by that. So within minutes, the truck driver, Ron Hill, the couple, and a few volunteers passed out loaves of bread to as many hungry travelers as they could along the two-mile stretch of the frozen highway. Uh, everybody was very thankful. A lot of them had small children, um, elderly couples. We can't stop raving about the humanity of everybody. And Casey and John tell me they finally ended up making it to their destination last night at 10 to North Carolina after over 30 hours of being in the car. They also tell me they made the trip to say goodbye to John's family before heading out to be stationed in the Air Force in Germany. And as you can imagine, guys, they say they don't plan on driving anytime soon. <laughs> I'm going to stay off the highway for a bit. I can understand that. I do. And you know, Amy, that bread must have tasted. Can you imagine how good that bread tasted oh, when you were starving like that? My goodness. They said, you... Yeah, they said it was the best bread they've ever tasted. They also said they handed out over about 600 loaves of bread to those hungry travelers around. So a lot of hungry people that were satisfied That's last night. That's a business night. that just gets it. Breaking bread on I 95. <laughs> there we well go. Said.